we have all of our audio and pictures. We have that inside of our NHS Technology NAS events project folder we created. And everything lives right here. So we're ready to edit on Premiere Pro. We gotta remember that we want to save our project file that we create in Premiere Pro inside of the project files folder. This is something that I see people struggle with all the time because this is, you, you spend hours and hours editing your project and then you can't find where your project is. Don't worry, it's really easy and you only have to do it once, but you have to do it correctly the first time. So when you open Premiere Pro, you're going to be able to create a new project and you can't just skip over this page, it's very important. The first thing that we're going to do is name this project what our folder name is. In this case, it's Journalism Project. So 2018-02-01 Journalism Project and then my name. This is for if it ever gets lost, we can quickly find stuff because we know the name of the project, the date it was made, and our name. The second thing that you have to do here is hit browse and save the project file to the right folder. So in this case it's NHS Technology, Events, go back to our journalism project right here and click on Project Files folder. That's going to save the project file to that right folder. Now when I hit OK, Premiere will open, but what I'll be able to do is see that now inside of my projects file I have that project file saved right there. So this is something that I see time and time again that people fail to do and it's the easiest way to get lost and, and ruin your project or delete your project. So make sure to save it to your project files folder.